Hey guys, I wanted to share this with you. Um, several, several months ago, four or five months ago, I'm sitting at home and I'm watching YouTube videos and uh, I found this website that would take a YouTube video and change it e either into an MP3 or an MP4. Now an MP4 is a video file. So I'm thinking, if I go to YouTube, take the address of the file that I want to turn into a video, and have it change it into an mp4 video I could make a disc of all music videos so what I did what I tried is I went and got a bunch of songs you know old songs and everything and uh, converted a bunch of them to a mp4 and then I took a DVD and I burned a DVD of all the songs it ended up being like about two and a half hours long approximately and I figured my car, the radio in my Mazda, has a DVD player. So I wondered if it would work. So what I did is I burned it, brought it out to the car, and now for my passengers, whenever I have a passenger in here, when we're driving, they can watch videos. Now, I can't run this sound too long because I'll get a copyright infringement, but this is uh, Bon Jovi's Wanted Dead or Alive. So it does work, and I now have two DVDs with about five hours or so of music videos that I can play in the car for my passengers, uh, you know, when we're driving around. I can't really do it myself, although I have just had it playing off to the side, and when I'm at a stop sign or a stoplight or something, I'll watch it. But, you know, you can't really watch a video when you're driving. But I thought that was a great idea. If your vehicle has a DVD player in it, um, and if you want to make a video CD of all music videos, that's the way to do it. Convert it into an MP4 file and then burn it to a DVD disc. And it will work. There's proof. Later. Happy Thursday, guys. It's May 7th, 2020. Uh, been home now for coming on almost two months. Um, as you know, I all did my kitchen and everything. Um, I was going to get a new um, faucet for the sink when I was done. I wanted to get one of those um, hand touch faucets and all that. You know, you just touch it and it goes on type of deal. But since I lost my job and those are kind of expensive, I decided to go with something cheaper but still nice. And this is what I got. It's still got the tall you know top to it <clears throat> the handle on off one thing pull down sprayer um, brush nickel same color as uh, the handles and the knobs and everything so uh, I'll probably be putting that on maybe tomorrow I got a home inspector coming uh, today to take pictures of the inside of the house because I changed insurance companies so they need to take pictures of the inside of the house make sure there's no damage blah 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 whatever and I got to remove the stuff from under the sink so I figure that'd be a good time I'll get the stuff out from under the sink today and then I'll probably put that faucet in tomorrow so I will show you that when uh, whenever I get it done more later guys have a good day just scored 18 mega rolls of toilet paper got it from office depot of all places um, found it online um, so I'm good now for three four months later okay guys well my battery in my Mazda is dead um, I put it in January 1st 2017 as you can see on there I always date my batteries when I put it in the last about three and a half years that's about average for down here but I'm gonna pull that out and uh, probably run up to O'Reilly Auto Parts up here tomorrow afternoon and grab me a new one not really what I was looking to do right now but got no choice all right guys later okay guys so I have not cut my grass since probably like February Still really doesn't look that bad right now, but I'm going to cut it anyway. 
Um, we haven't had a whole lot of rain this year, so that's why. But I'm going to cut it anyway, so just letting you know. guys happy Mother's Day um, I'm going to try to do a zoom meeting with my mom I set this up earlier in the week I've never done a zoom thing before I don't even know if this is gonna work or not but I'm going to click on the link here to join the meeting I don't know if she's there yet or not I have no idea and I don't know how this works so I'm going to try this and we'll see what happens here so let's see what happens I'm not really sure how this works. So, we'll see what happens here. I don't know uh, how this is going to work. Let's see. Do -do 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 -do. Let's see. Like I said, I don't know. It says launching. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. There it goes. Let's see. Please wait for the. Okay, I'm the host. off here I need to log in to start this meeting let's see crap uh, all right let's see I will edit this crap. I don't remember. Let me see. Don't remember to hold on. <clears throat> okay, I had to do some stuff here, so now let's see if I can start this meeting. Let's see if this works. Amazon. Okay, I can do that. Join the computer audio. Okay. Comments on is waiting for the meeting. Okay, admit. See if this works. Are you there? Hi. Can you see me? Yeah, it worked. <laughs> okay, wait. Say, say, say hi to YouTube. Hi, everybody. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you, sweetheart. Okay, hold on. I did it. I finally got on Zoom meeting. Okay, more later. Bye. My mailman, Tom, is going to be coming around the corner here soon. So, I thought I'd show you that. He's a good friend of mine. Uh, good guy. Great guy. Went to baseball games together and all that stuff. So, I will show you when he comes up. Yep, and here he comes. That's my buddy Tom. That's my mailman. He's really cool. I love him. He's great. Just thought I'd show you. Alright, later. Okay guys, it is uh, Tuesday the 11th, 12th, 12th of May. Um, I just sprayed my house for bugs. A very long overdue spraying inside and out. I want to show you what I what I use. It's uh, 
It's Taurus SC. It's a, a type of uh, termite insecticide. That stuff, I mean, that stuff, it kills everything. It kills everything. It kills termites, earwigs, spiders, potato bugs, ants, roaches. Uh, it, it even kills uh, shit, everything. Termites, everything. It kills everything. The way I do it, I spray it around the outside of my house from the ground up about two feet. And then I spray all the, the window frames outside. And then I go inside and I do an outer uh, sweep of the, all the outside walls and all the windows and doors. Just spray all around. Nice good 5-6 inch uh, spray on everything. And I've been using that stuff for probably since like 2003, 2002. Way back then I've been using that same stuff. It lasts forever. It lasts like 3-4 months per application. So you're going to do it like you know maybe 2-3 times a year at the most. And that bottle that I showed you... That thing, you only use like not even a full ounce all the time. So that bottle lasts quite a while. I bought that one probably like two, almost three years ago probably. So I just noticed my battery is getting low. So I'll end this one now. More later. Okay, guys. So it is uh, Tuesday, May 12th. I cut the front grass yesterday, as you've seen. <clears throat> um, kicked on my sprinklers for the first time since... I think December was the last time that I had them on. Everything seems to be working good. They all seem to be going off okay. So I'm going to let this run for a little bit, give the grass a little bit of water because we're, uh, we're not expecting any rain until like uh, Saturday or Sunday. And even then it's only supposed to be a little bit. But I'll give the grass a little bit of a watering now. I want, just wanted to check the sprinklers. Here comes some water. Just wanted to check the sprinklers, make sure they were still working right because they haven't been on in quite a long time. But everything looks good on this section anyway. So, more later. See ya. Okay guys, uh, I did the front yard with the sprinklers. Worked fine. I went to do this side over here and I've got like no pressure. Nothing whatsoever. I mean very little. I mean I just shut them off. But there was very little. Um, in the backyard, there are two sprinklers on the side of the house here. One of them had a huge puddle around it. So I'm guessing that's where I'm losing all the water pressure from. And the other one wasn't coming up at all. I don't know if it's just blocked or whatever. But that's a project for another day. Later. Okay, guys. So I'm going to be putting in my faucet there. Hopefully I'm not going to break anything, so we will see. I will show you when we're done. Okay, well, ending that project, went to shut off the valve for the cold water, and it broke. So, now I guess I'm going to have to get a plumber. Always something. Okay guys, so I just got back from Home Depot. I got me these uh, Shark Bite uh, shutoff valves for uh, my kitchen. Uh, I got a copper pipe cutter, got some sandpaper to get the old one off. Um, just waiting for my buddy to come by. She'll probably be here another two hours or so. And then we're gonna dive in and see if we can replace those valves. So I'll let you know what happens. See ya. Okay guys, so here's what we're going to do. We need to take this valve off, and we need to take that valve off. They're compression fittings on the pipe, so what we're going to do is we're going to shut the main water off in the house, and then we're going to take these off. We're going to have to cut the compression ring off of it, which means we're going to have to cut the pipe back a little bit. And then we'll put the new valves on, and then we should be good. So, I'll let you know what happens. Alright guys, so we got these on. The water is all back on. Pressure is still up. We don't have a single drop of leaking. So, I think we're good. Tomorrow I am going to 
put the new kitchen faucet in, hook those up, and hopefully we'll be good. See you then. Okay guys, what a pain in the ass that was, but you know what, it's done, it looks good, not the exact kind I wanted, but good enough, but anyway, I'm going to end this video with that, um, I think that was more than enough, uh, hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, if you haven't yet, click the subscribe button, like the video, share it with your friends or whatever, I'm going to make a second video of just putting in the valves on the thing so that's going to be a sub video off of this one so but that's been the last like two weeks or so so take care guys i'll talk to you in a couple weeks